hi guys welcome to the Hill channel i'm super super excited to have you guys here today so today we're discussing about this promo card strategy but before we uh dive into the strategy i want you guys to know something that uh trading is a very risky business and if you can't risk you can't reach in the world of trading and if you know that you are, you are the type of person that you want to risk then don't don't uh, even involve in trading because trading is a risky business and with trading you can become everything you want in your life and with trading you can also uh, become the worst person in your life so if you can't go with the risk involved with trading then do expect to don't even start trading in the worst place to even start trading and if you know that uh, you're the type of someone that uh, you you uh you have issue with risking then don't uh why are you contacting us in the first place don't, so don't even bother to contact us if you know that you can't risk and if you know that you don't want to go with the risk you have trade then don't even bother to contact because i get a lot of messages from people uh telling me this telling me that and get frustrated sometimes i uh, even uh my people my poor and my mentees even gets get some uh frustrating as well People telling them all this kind of thing, telling them, telling them this, telling them that. So, if you know you can't risk it, then don't even bother to contact. So, I just want you guys to know that. So, that was more of our time that we can jump into the trade, into the history video. So, uh, today we're discussing about this boom market strategy, and you can see I do a strategy right here. So, I'll be, we'll be discussing about the strategy. But before we jump in, I want you quickly guys to know that if you are new to the driver channel, don't forget to subscribe. Like I turn a post notification anytime we're able to post new strategy, you guys should be aware. And also, guys, if you want to manage your account, if you want someone to manage your account, or you want to know, don't be scared. So, if you want to manage your account, just cut out the number you are seeing that screen, then we are going to manage your account for you. We are going to send you the terms and conditions, everything you need to know before we collect your account and manage it for you because we don't want any issues. So, Send you our times if you accept if you accept with our times, then we are going to manage your account for you. And if you don't, then this okay by us. So, with that being said, let's quickly jump into now. Let's jump into the strategy. So, this strategy uh, is used on five minutes. We're going to be using some five minute time frame. Now, the funny part is that I was able to uh, take this trade on five minute time frame, and, and I was able to hold the trade because I know that I know I already, although I already know the market direction. Like the market is going to the downside, but eventually I was able to check the trade on five minute time frame. And the, the, this, strategy, this strategy is the one that gave me the uh, confirmation and the entry mode rails that I was able to utilize to check the trade. And since then, I was able to hold the trade to make more money. So, now as you can see, I've already shown you guys that now. Without waiting much of time, let's quickly jump into this strategy. So, for now, I'll be teaching you guys this strategy. So, before I tell you guys how you can make your strategy to make money trading the boomer crash. Now, this is the first indicator that we need. I won't be able to release this uh, this indicator up, so I'll be showing you guys one after the other. Now, join this indicator up, then click on the F plus. When you click on the F plus, just search for your moving average. Then you click on the moving average. So, when you click on the moving average, it's parameters you need for the moving average. It's build the state shift zero. The method is simple. Apply to close and then I'm going to be using the red color. You can choose any color of your choice. Now click on done, you set it up, and then it's going to be add into your uh main chart. Now to so add the next thing to add is the calculator considerator. So the first thing you want to click, you're also going to click on the F plus. So you click on the F plus, you search for your stochastic consider, you then click on it. So you click on the stochastic consider, this parameters we need for the stochastic consider. K period is 100, the deep period is 1, slow period slowing is 1, the price. Speed is close, close, method is exponential, and the style, we don't need the style. Now, the levels, we are going to need the 10 and the 90 levels. So, that's the level that we need, and you can use any color of your choice. So, when you set it up like this, then click on done. Now, the next thing we are going to be adding inside the moving average. So, when I set this to so the top, it's going to be listed on our indicator window one. So, we click on the indicator window one, I plus to add the next indicator up. Now, click on it, then the next thing you want to do is set for your moving average. Then when you get your moving average, these parameters you need for the moving average. The period is one, shift zero, the method is exponential, apply to close, and this time I'm going to be using the black color. So when you set it up like this, then click on done. 
and then you are going to have your moving average and the next the next thing we're going to be adding is also going to be the moving average so click on the plus search for your moving average and then these are the parameters we need for the move second moving average and if you hold 50 50 the method is exponential apply to close and the style you are going to be using the red color so when set up like this then you click on done now the last one on the list indicator we are going to be adding is also going to be the moving average now search for the indicator search for your moving average the parameter the period is 120 shift the new method is exponential apply to close and i'm going to be using the purple color so you can choose any color of your choice as well then we we'll set it up like this and click on done and you can see to have your settings that is going to look like this now i am not going to make use of this strategy to make money now i post this this year that i was that i took my trade now i'll be using this year that i took my trade now the first thing you want to see before taking any trade is that you want to see that uh, your indicator window one you want to force that this all these moving average need need to move to the 90 levels and you want to see that this i um, need to move the 90, 90 levels of the classical indicator and you want to see this red this black moving average right here moving below all the other indicator which is the purple and the red one you can see the black moving average moving below there and you want to see the this area, area as well now although i didn't wait for the for this uh for the price to move below the moving average but for a clear confirmation we need to make sure that you wait for the price to move below the moving average the moving average now in your main chart and you wait for the price to come back to its moving average then you wait for a perfect, perfect signal the perfect thing you are waiting for is you want to wait for at least one spike which is the spike we are seeing right here so you wait for this spike right here when the spike occur then you jump into your position Jump into your position and close your trade when you see the price almost reaching the 10 levels of the stochastic oscillator. Now, you need to wait for the uh, price to almost reach the 10 levels before you close your positions. Now, that is for a sell trade and for a buy for a buy trade. Now, that is what you need to see. And the first thing you want to see is that you want to see this. Right here, we see uh, all the, the moving away touching the 10 levels of the stochastic oscillator. When you see that, you want to see the rejection right here. You want to see that this black moving away right here crossing above all the other indicator. So, when you see that, then you, you, you go to your chart and look for something like this. You need to see this moving away, this red moving away right here moving above the price. Using that the price moving you need to move above the moving average. So when this price moving about the moving average, then wait for a candle, a candle close right here. Wait for a candle to, wait for a candle to close above the price right here. Then you need to, you need to know something right here. Now for a clear entry, then you need to wait for the price, for the candle to close above all the all the area of value, which means that the area the market do spike. All this area you are seeing right here. Wait for a candle to close above it you can see this candle close above it so you are expected to enter the position where you see this candle right here you see this candle you are seeing right here and then you close your positions you close your buy as the price also reach, almost reaching the next resistance area or the price almost reaching the almost reaching the 90 levels of the stochastic oscillator that's when you are going to close your position so as simple as that just a simple strategy as the quick one and you can also make use of the strategy on uh, the boom in this and it does an opposite direction so uh, i think you guys find this video helpful so maybe i should teach you guys how you can use your strategy on boom as well but just just similar aspects just similar aspects you all you need to wait for right here just to wait for uh the confirmation key entries everything so you always wait for that and then you drop into your position so as simple as i just simple strategy so i hope you guys find this video helpful if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe like i turn on a post notification and that was able to post your strategy you guys will be aware you can see right now we are already on into a five hundred dollar prop for speed so thank you guys i'll see you in the next video bye